Hello, and welcome to the Naviance curriculum tutorial for the New Tech High staff. As you see, when you log into Naviance, it's going to look very similar. However, over in the quick links to the left, there's going to be a new link for Naviance curriculum. We're going to utilize the Naviance curriculum instead of the old tasks that we used in Family Connection. Some of the tasks and activities that were held in Family Connection will still be utilized within the context of the Naviance curriculum. To launch the Naviance curriculum, simply click on the link. In the new Naviance curriculum, you're going to be able to access a plethora of resources. First, you're going to be able to preview lessons for your particular advisory students. So for example, if I look at the ninth grade lessons, you'll be able to see all the lessons that are attached to the ninth grade students. Throughout the course of the year, we're going to do a selected few of these that will help our students college and career readiness. Up at the top, you'll see two drop down menus. First in curriculum, it will take you to the lesson previews or a more detailed lesson plan. For each of the lesson plans, there's two resources. One takes you back to the preview. Another one takes you to a uh, lesson plan activity that will help you better understand exactly what that lesson is asking students to do. The other one is a student drop down menu. This will take you to what your classes are for advisory. Each advisory is broken up into two classes in Naviance curriculum, a ninth grade curriculum, uh, an 11th grade curriculum for 9-11 advisories, and a 10th grade curriculum and 12th grade curriculum uh, for 10-12 advisories. In this classes tab, you'll be able to edit information as well as see your roster, activity, and progress. These are the same things that you can see in the drop-down menu up here under students. If I look at roster, I can see which students are assigned uh, to that particular group. If I look at activity, it will let me see what students are assigned uh, particular activities, how many times they've logged in, how many lessons they've completed, what their plans are. I can view specific plans as well as what plans they've completed. The last piece of this is then progress. For each of my advisory classes, I can see what students have completed uh, the assigned lessons. Again, we will not assign all 17 lessons per grade level. So some students will have some lessons that they don't complete, but they complete on their own. So this tab will allow you to, to track and pro, uh, keep progress of how your students are doing in the new Naviance curriculum. Again, we still have the ability within Naviance to look at specific student data. So if I look at a student, I can then still look at their courses that they've uh, planned out, different and various assessment scores, the colleges that they are looking at uh, applying to or they have applied to, as well as other uh, uh, data points. This information is still available to us. However, we will utilize the Naviance curriculum to guide our students in their college and career preparedness. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask Ms. Martinez, Ms. Miller, or Mr. Johnson about how you can utilize this Naviance curriculum with your advisory or even potentially as a scaffolding piece in varying projects. Thank you, and we're excited that this is a new uh, style and format for the way that we use Naviance as a school at New Tech High.